I wonder if you've uh, ever complained uh, that reading is difficult, uh, that it's hard to find the time and to sit down and plough through a book that you've been meaning to read uh, but have never quite got round to. Or perhaps you've uh, been listening to a lecture or someone talking and you've said to yourself, it's so hard to sit and listen. I'm sure that's never happened here. But the truth is, of course, uh, that it's not always difficult to read, is it? It's not always difficult to listen. I'm sure we've all had the experience of a book that we simply cannot put down. Uh, perhaps we've been reading it into the early, um, early hours of the morning, and it's so gripped our attention that we cannot put it down. Or perhaps a TV or a radio program which we are glued to and we almost don't realise we're watching it because we're so absorbed with what we are listening to. But nevertheless, we've also, also always had, also had the experience of uh, a book that is deathly dull or something which is deadly dull to listen or watch. And that experience helps us to understand what the book of Hebrews is talking about in these verses. Uh, as you remember last week, we were looking at how Christ is our high priest. He is the one who makes our peace with God. He is truly man, yet he is also able to make peace with God. And we learned last week how...